This New York talent goes by just one name, but we know him by the many movies and TV shows he's appeared in. On the big screen, he's delivered classics such as Cool Runnings, Above the Rim, and Waiting to Exhale. And he's also portrayed music icons Little Richard and David Ruffin on The Temptations. And with a role on The Chai and two movies, it is now the season of Leon, the actor, singer, producer, <laughs> and director sitting down with us this morning to talk about it all. Good to see you, my friend. How are we doing? Yeah, I'm good. I'm happy to be here. Yeah, Leon, I mean, it must feel good to be busy. Yeah, no, especially, <laughs> after, especially after that strike last year. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah definitely. So how, talk about kind of managing it all at the same time. It's, um, it's tough, yeah. you know, especially between the, the music and the acting. Yeah. Um, but, you know, whatever comes first, whatever, you know, is there, I just knock it out and right, just right. wait for the next phone to ring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. I mean, he was just saying that you, you're making an appearance on The Shy. Let's take a look at a clip, and yeah. then we'll talk about it on the other side. So, who's this? It's a new lawyer. Alonzo Daniels Lafayette. What do I need a lawyer for? Come with me. All right, so you play Alonzo, who's an attorney. Tell us a little bit about his story, because you play opposite of what, Alicia, played by Lynn Whitfield? Yes, exactly. Lynn's a wonderful actress, so, you know, a chance to get in there and, you know, get in the ring with her is always fun. Yeah. Um, Alonzo is the type of attorney that, um, gangsters like. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. When you're in trouble, you know, you call Alonzo. Yeah, there you <laughs> go. The fixer. He's the fixer. Yeah, kind of like that. Yeah. yeah. You know, the show is huge. It's got, like, such a big following, too. So, you know, like I said, you got a lot going on, but that's the show you were like, i got to be part of it. Yeah, you know, it was actually a chance to, you know, get to work with some really good people. I think Lena White's done a great job yeah. of uh, assembling a great crew, cast, producers, writers. So when they asked me to be on the show, I, you know, I said, yeah, of course. Right, right, yeah, right. Of course. So what has the experience been like working with all those great stars? Great. You know, I love Chicago. Chicago's a great city. I get a lot of love there. Even when my band performs, they're sold out. So it's, I love it. And um, yeah, it's just, it's been a great experience. You know, a lot of love. Your yeah. band? Tell us about your band. Yeah. Oh, Leon and the People. Yeah. There you go. Uh, we, we play a blend between reggae and soul music. I like it. Yeah, we, we consider ourselves like the Sly and the Family Stones of reggae. Okay. Oh, yeah. that's cool. Yeah, so there you my go. band's half women, half men. Yeah. And um, yeah, we, we just did a city winery tour and, and we just were all over the place. Yeah. You also have a new film um, coming out, Rhythm and the Blues. Right. Hit the Big Apple uh, Film Festival. Yeah, What's at the Lincoln film about? Center last weekend. Yeah. yeah, it was great. What's the film about? It's about um, a blues artist. Eddie Taylor, one of the great blues artists that a lot of people don't know about. Okay. Influenced so many different people. And his story is like so many great artists that just didn't get their just due. So Daryl Pitts, the director, asked me to do this movie because he wanted to highlight, you know, Chicago artists right. that, you know, the people don't know about, but yet they hear their wrists with a lot of big artists and, yeah. they, and people don't know and they're not getting paid the royalties either. Right, right, right. Yeah, I mean, what's it like for you? Because you are a musician to, be, to play artists like this. I mean, you played what, Little Richard at one point. Yes. Um, what is it? Is there a pressure for you to be able to fulfill who they were and their greatness? Do you ever feel that? I think when you take on someone who actually walked and talked on this yeah. earth, mm -hmm. um, you have a responsibility to capture their essence, you know, so Whatever that person was about, whatever that person meant in their lives, you have to try to capture that because yeah. there's people that know them mm -hmm. and you owe that to them. Well, so. yeah, it's their legacy, right? Yeah, without a doubt. Uh, so while all of that's going on, then there's the Knicks. New uh, York Knicks, yeah. baby! Right, there's the Knicks. Let's go! <laughs> and uh, <laughs> you've been games. seeing a lot of you at the Knicks games. Yes, you're going to see a lot of me at the Knicks games. Okay. Yeah, I'm one of the lucky people on Celebrity Row that get to be yeah. there and cheer on their team. It's a, it's a good time. Right okay, now. I mean, just yesterday, or two days ago, I mean, 30-point 30, 30 lead. Well, they 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 needed to give that After the Mother's Day massacre, we'll yeah. Just yeah, I was like, you got, you got 30, well, we got 30 plus. Exactly, right. exactly. Right. So that, it's very exciting. I'm looking forward to tomorrow. Okay. And I hope tomorrow goes well. Where are you watching <laughs> the game from, then? Are you going to fly out there? No. Actually, I'm going to be in Orlando in okay. a hotel room screaming by myself. There you go. Um, but, um, yeah, I'm just happy that we're finally good again. <laughs> good again, <laughs> right. yes. Let's right. hope we, they wrap it up. Yes, I'm I fine. hope so, too. Great <laughs> to see you, Leon. Thanks yeah, for coming by. Thank Let's you. go next. Let's yes. go next. Let's go next.